Okay, this is the second part. I uh, apologise. Um, I used to have Camtasia, but it won't work on my new computer uh, on Vista. So I've, um, I'm having to use Jing, and you can only record for five minutes at a time. That's why it, uh, I tend to have to chop these off fairly slowly. Okay, uh, part two, we'll get rid of that. Now, if you remember, we had these two buttons going over, and we were um, had the we're going in these loops or going in that loop and one of the important things we've also got to remember is that if you go here the problem is if you would go over that they will get into into this loop but unless you most most over the products one it would stay in that loop so you have to make a an escape one so in the back bar here um, just let me bring up the thing um, it says when it mouses over that then we jump to frame mouse off stop which is back to the original frame and that stops the animation so, so in other words to stop it just getting into that loop continuously when it mouses over any anywhere outside and into that it will go back to that stop that animation and become um, static again all right so we've now we can now though uh, test that and i'll just show you what happens there um disregard that because it doesn't really make one one difference and there's the uh there's the thing in and if we go mouse over about us it goes fine you go products it goes fine you get that animation instead of just having a mouse over um so that's fine notice when I go, go off the button it stops if I, otherwise if I hadn't put that go back to mouse off of state it wouldn't stop it, it would just carry on even though your mouse had gone off so it doesn't matter where it goes unless you actually lift the mouse off the off the table it works pretty well okay so what's the next stage just let me uh, shut that down right um, now when we get into this layer that's just the mouse over that's very good but you've got to have an action to actually take you somewhere else um, so when I click on this mouse over we're now remembering the mouse when I'm in the mouse off layers sorry about that when we're in that mouse off layer um, it told it to go here but now we're here and it's jiggling between those two we want it to go somewhere else if somebody clicks on it so we have to then go put a link onto it and the, the link is link to web address index htm which is your initial file um, make sure that correct address automatically is not ticked otherwise that will go completely wrong because Zara will put in an http colon forward slash forward slash in there, and you don't want that because it won't work and the other thing that's very important when you're using Swift is that the open the link in the same window curly bra open brackets underscore top close brackets is the is the only one that will work if you try any of the self the parent any um, blank or not specified it won't work it must be same window top okay so that's what that is on that one um, on the products go down to here on the products we then have oh, I must have I don't know if I've lost that link somewhere along the way I'll stop that a minute and uh, I'll get back to you in a minute